How's it going everybody? Arthur Reyes here at runningsandminers.com and today we have one MLB game we're going to be discussing for the Sunday, August 27, 2023 slate of games. But before we get into that, I want to talk to you guys quickly about a promotion we are running over at runningsandminers.com where you guys can save 70% off on all of my packages until further notice if you use the promo code ALDKV70. That is all one word, no spaces. Make sure to go check out my profile as well as some of our other top performers. In addition to the video that you get today, just like this, that you will be having every day on YouTube.com for free. You guys would also get access to my written picks. You guys also get access to what I am betting on throughout the day. So you guys can see what I am interested in throughout the entire day's worth of games. Also, in the description below is a link to all of our affiliate sportsbook promotional signups. So, if you guys are in the market for a brand new sportsbook, if you guys just want to take advantage of some free sports bets, make sure to go over to the link in the description below. Click on that. Brings you to a very simplistic website. Tells you which sportsbooks we offer, what the bonus bets would be, and a link to sign up. You guys sign up. You guys obviously get those free bonus bets. We get an affiliate bonus for you guys using our code. So, it's a win-win for everybody. Looking back at yesterday, we had the Raiders to cover the spread in the preseason finale against the loss, or excuse me, against the Dallas Cowboys. The Cowboys ended up dominating. They ended up winning 31 to 16. So we obviously lost that bet. We are now 117 and 104 in our previous 221 video picks. So let's get back on the winning side of things as we are going to be discussing an American League matchup. Taking place in the afternoon here, it's going to be the Oakland Athletics taking on the Chicago White Sox. It's going to be Paul Blackburn on the mound for Oakland. It's going to be Mike Clevenger on the mound for Chicago. And a big thing is the ability to hit with runners in scoring position. We kind of saw it a little bit yesterday, and I kind of want to just go over that. As Oakland yesterday was 1 for 9 with runners in scoring position. Uh, Chicago was 3 for 8 yesterday, and that was a big reason why the White Sox were able to win 6 to 2. Now, looking at the pitching splits throughout the season so far, Paul Blackburn on the road, 2 and 1. He's pitching to a 4.29 ERA, a 322 batting average against in 8 home starts. Or, excuse me, on 8 road starts. Mike Clevenger, on the other hand, is 3 and 2 with a 2.63 ERA, a 228. Opposing batting average in his eight starts at home this season. All of that is to say, I really like this White Sox team a lot more than I like this Oakland Athletics team as they are struggling. So give me Chicago minus one and a half is my play for today. That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you guys in the next one.